So I did a good job of following what I said I was going to do yesterday and doing four meals, but smaller meals. I kept them smaller portion. Um, so happy I did that. I feel like maybe the posterior adult work I'm doing is actually making a difference because I just feel like my neck and shoulders are more mobile and less tense. But we'll see. Mm. Um, I feel great digestive wise. Um, I'm not sure if it's the butternut squash adding more carbs and that clogging things up, cause more gas maybe. I'm not going to have it tomorrow and see how it goes. I'm going to try to go see a movie on Thursday. I really want to. It's been over two years now since I've been in a movie theater, which is one of my favorite places. Um, I need to do better free focusing after meals and keeping my focus on my to-do list, not anything else. Needing to give myself a goal, not only of something I do, but also results, because I'm not getting any results, and I don't like it. I just feel like I'm not gaining anything, so I need to be more results focused. The other stoic today is they can throw you in chains, but it's a quote from Epictetus saying, You can bind up my legs, but not even Zeus has the power to break my freedom of choice. Um, Epictetus walked with a permanent limp as a result of his. Um, time as a slave and being in chains. 2,000 years later and James Scott Stocksdale um, was also, you know, the person from yesterday after he was put in prison for seven years. They bound up his legs as well and, you know, they tie his hands behind his back and hoist them up and his arms would dislocate and John McCain was in the same, same prison uh, suffered the same abuse but during his time he was actually because his father was famous um, they offered for him to abandon his fellow inmates and offered him a chance to go home be free. But despite that, he held tightly to his freedom of choice and declined the offer, declined submitting to the temptation of his freedom, um, despite, you know, not having to be tortured. And yeah. So, all three of them all were able to maintain themselves and not be broken. No one took a, they tried to make them sacrifice the principles.
Damn it. No, just keep going. They can put them in chains, but they don't have the power to change who you are. They can torture you. You can suffer the worst cruelties um, that humans can give to one another. But we ultimately have power over our minds, and have power over our choices. Those can't be broken, but they can only be relinquished. No one can make no one of these men broke. No one can make them sacrifice for principles. Got it. All right, I'm going to bed.